Hey guys, Streaming Rank War Veteran here back with a quick video. This is going to be about my new charger. This is the Traxxas Easy Peak Live a high output 12 amp charger. As you can see, I got a battery plugged in there. I like this one a lot. A, because the fan's bigger. And you can sit there and use Bluetooth with it. And when you use Bluetooth, it tells you the status so you know your battery's charging or not charging. It tells you the voltages. It tells you other information here. That's the information on the battery and the part number. And those are the voltages. Charging status, how long it's going to take, percentage. That's why I never liked this phone. It's going to be stupid. As you see, there it is. And right now it's charging at 11.6 amps. It's like a 30 minute charge for a battery. And that's your, uh, the bottom number is your milliamp input. So you can watch it right from your cell phone, wherever you are, as long as you're in Bluetooth range. Only one fan on the unit, which is fine. It's a lot bigger fan, so. <laughs> but I like this one better than the uh, standard one, which is right down here. This is the standard upgraded one for LiPos. Well, the normal one for LiPos, actually. Because you need this for the LiPo charging. You can't use the other ones. Because they need to be balanced charged. And those little ones don't do balanced charging. Let's see if I can find one. Don't mind things. It's been shit here lately. Well, it's not this one, but it's, you get the idea. <clears throat> These are the standard uh, chargers, and you can't charge light bulbs with these. As you can see, it says it right here. Because it does not do balanced charging. If you do use one of these, you can do it for a little bit just to get a charge. So maybe that, that will read it, or the other style will read it that's down there. But I would not completely charge with this. It will ruin it, or it has a chance of catching on fire. But this is the one with a car. I have the regular one. This is the car adapter one. Um, oh, it is down here. <clears throat> this is the one you can buy extra in the store. This is the 2 amp version. It's good for 5 to 7 cells for the nickel metal. The one that comes with them is a 4 amp that you can plug into your car. Let me see here. It's 6 to 7 cells with the 4 amp. 5 to 7 with these ones. But these, I just don't like them because the only thing they have is a blinking light. That's it. So, that's when I went to... Went and bought one of these when I bought the LiPos because you need them. Because those ones can't charge it. I'm still not very happy with this one because they should have some kind of readout on here that tells you voltages or charging or whatever besides just these lights. Uh, I was having issues with it seemingly not charging stuff like it should be charging. But I guess what I found out later that it was just taking longer than it should. It was charging at a slower rate for some reason. Maybe because the batteries weren't completely dead. But that can't really be the case since this one's charging at 11.6 amps right now. But this one, I think the peak on this is just 4 amp. So this one's a, it's supposedly a fast charger, but not that fast, obviously. And the fan size on this is, is tiny. I like the fan on that one much better. I mean, you can see the size differences. Alright guys, I'm streaming Rack War Veteran. If you have any questions on these, uh, definitely let me know. Have a good one.